Good morning, Northtown. I'm Tyler Lovelace. And I'm Josiah Mendoza. Today is Wednesday, December 12th. It is Holiday Spirit Week, and today is Hat and Socks Day. Today, we'll take a look at the best restaurants, an upcoming debate, and a journalist's final words. All on NTV News. Okay, let's start off with a look at what's buzzing around Northtown. Your book is looking for photos of what you think makes Northtown unique. You can email them to 713765 at nkcschools.org or tag it, to, uh, tag it on Instagram at pergold. Again, that is 713765 at nkcschools.org. <laughs> Congrats to the NKC Stingers in their first competition of the year. First place Division Three Prop, third place Division Three Hip Hop, and fifth place Junior Solo. Also, congrats to NKC Cheer on their first place finish at Regionals. Way to go! Seniors, if you haven't verified your name for your diploma, please stop by the Registrar's Office in South Campus. Rocket Club will meet tonight immediately after school in B134. Juniors, the college planning presentation and work session has been moved to, to tonight at 6.30 in the NKC Public Library meeting room. Please contact counseling with any questions. There will be a host of meetings tonight after school from 2.45 to 4. There will also be no tutoring at Crestview until we return from break. The first tutoring date will be January 8th. The Avid Club will hold their end of the semester party this Friday during advisory in Norclay 8.34. Please bring a snack to share. The Young Americans for Freedom and the Young Democrats of Northtown will be meeting on Thursday after school for a joint social followed by a political debate. This is an open event that anyone may come to spectate. The yearbook staff will be posting rough draft previews of the yearbook portrait pages in Norclay and Beaming this week. Please check the printouts to make sure your name is spelled correctly. Please send any corrections to Mrs. Pritchard in Norclay 819 by Friday. Stuco is collecting money for Adopt-A-Family to give some families in our community some more Christmas joy. Here's a look at how you can help. For several years, Northtown has participated in the Adopt-A-Family program in which students raise money to buy gifts for select families, which they are doing in multiple ways. Every student council member has a jar which collects money and then at the end we count up all that money. We go and buy presents for that family, we wrap them, and then we deliver them to the adopt -a family facility. Stuco also sold winter grams to raise money for the cause, and our school's involvement in this program has had a positive effect on our community. The students really get behind working towards a goal to help those in need, especially this time of year, so I think it's a wonderful program. adopt -a family has put the season of giving into full swing. In world news, we get insight on the death of a journalist, Jamal Khashoggi. On October 2nd, 2018, Jamal Khashoggi, a Saudi journalist known for his opposition to the oppressive Saudi Arabian government, was assassinated inside the Saudi consulate in Istanbul, Turkey. Following his murder, speculation that the Saudi, Saudi government was involved arose in November, those speculations were confirmed to be true. <laughs> More details are now arising about his gruesome murder as the audio now exposes his last words, which were, I can't breathe. The journalist's death has caused uproar as many view the murder as violent government suppression of the media. The investigation is still ongoing. Both boys and girls basketball took on a conference opponent this week in William Christman. Boys basketball got their win 57-56 to bring their record to 1-3. And, and girls basketball also emerged victorious, winning 40-31. Congrats to our Hornet basketball. TripAdvisor's list of this year's favorite restaurants is finally out. Will your favorites be on the list? It's all under your internet highlight.
When thinking of your favorite restaurant, you might rattle off McDonald's, Taco Bell, Olive Garden, or Panera. Well, TripAdvisor's top 25 restaurants that offer high quality meals at great value on the go include, in first place, Portillo's, number two, Earl Sandwich, number three, Steak Shake Shack, number four, Blaze Pizza, and five, In-N-Out Burger. Did that shock you? You may find a complete list online. And there's our show for today, Northtown. To find more NTV episodes, subscribe to our YouTube channel, NTV at NKCHS. To stay up to date on everything that's buzzing around Northtown, follow us on Twitter at Northtown News. And for photos and announcements, you can find us and like us on Facebook at NKC Journalism. Thanks for watching, Northtown. Keep it classy. And as always, it's a great day to be a Hornet.